Hello everybody, welcome back to Pixie Woo. Um, a look I'm going to do for you today is basically um, spring summer fashion. So um, I fed up with winter, I don't want to think about the winter anymore. So I've had a look on um, Vogue, see what some of the new spring summer collections are going to be. And basically it's about brights. It normally is about brights every, um, every summer. So you can get all your old faithful colours out like Lady Danger which I showed you in the last video. Uh, but it's all about brights on the eyes, brights on the lips. You don't have to wear them both together, or you can. It's totally up to you. It depends how how much you want to wear. So it's about these bright greens, bitter from Mac. You've got your electric eel, um, aquadisiac. You can go for your warm corals. I think that's a very pretty colour. That one is called coral, but it's a Mac Pro colour. I'll show you on my hand. It's a really, we can't really see it so much there, but it is nice bright coral. Some of these colours are difficult to wear. If you're finding them hard to wear, it's worth putting a little bit of black liner just underneath them and then a lot of mascara. Because it's the only reason they're hard to wear is because either you're colouring or because um, you can't see the eyelashes, so I think you need an extra mascara for this. Um, all of these colours look amazing on black skin, so you can wear it as well. Um, you know, Rihanna rocks them as well. She wears all these bright colours. So I would say go for it. Even the yellows. Yellow is quite hard to wear. I can't do yellow. Um, right, let's get started. I am going to really moisturise my skin with my faithful oilatum. I'm going to use Estee Lauder So Ingenious Foundation. Right, I will come back to powder that. If you want to use a primer, pop a primer on. My skin is so dry, if I put a primer on, it looks like a little prune. Let's do the eyeshadow. This is where you put your primer on your eyes as well, if you're going to use a primer. I actually prefer not to. I like the um, finish and I like to blend over the concealer or the foundation. I think I'm going to use Bright Green Bitter. I haven't used that for a long, long, long time, so I'm going to show you. You can either get bitter or sour lemon. This one's bitter from MAC. Sour lemon is the pro colour that they do. I think that's what it's called. It's pretty much the same colour, though. So I'm just using a 217 MAC brush. and one colour all over the top of the eye. It's a very quick eyeshadow to do. Because the sun's shining, who wants to be inside putting their makeup on? I want a lot of mascara, so I'm going to use Zoom Lash Mascara. I need to get some new mascaras, they're drying out a bit. Lots of mascara, I'm actually going to go back and put even more on than that. I'm going to use a little bit of my Bobbi Brown Natural Brow Shaper. Just on my eyebrows. And then I'm going to go in with some more mascara, build that up. Okay, it's bronzing as well, so there's a lot of bronzing involved. I've got um, a Avon one. Oh, actually, this isn't Avon. I don't know if you can get this in the UK. This is Mark. Um, it's part of Avon. 
Um, I'll show you what it looks like, but I'll give you an alternative as well, actually, because I don't know if this is available in the UK. I like this because it's not too bronze. It doesn't, um, it's not too dark, so for summer, it gives a healthy glow without being really contoured and really too dark. Okay, let me find one on the other side. For the other side. There you go, there's a Chanel one here, that'll do. And the Chanel Bronze Universal. So if you want to keep that really creamy look, I'm going to pop a tiny bit of um, my Sleek Makeup Blush in Rose Gold. They do loads of other colours, so it's worth going to have a look. Um, some of them are a little bit too dark for me. So I'm going to pop a little bit of this. Just on the apples of the cheeks. And then for the lips, you can go for... A really nude lipstick, any nude lipstick, lip gloss or lipstick that you want. This is Barry M in number four. Let's pop that on to show you. Mm, that smells nice. So you can have that quick, effortless look, or and just wipe that lip gloss off. I am going to use Illamasqua Lip Liner in Titivate. And inside of that I'm going to put Impassion from MAC. You can use a brush if you want, I just wanted to show you a really quick way of doing it. And I think that's a really summery look. In fact, I really like that. It makes me feel summery already. I haven't even used any concealer. I'm going to put some concealer on under my eyes and a little bit on my blemish on my chin. Studio Finish Concealer in NW30 and a MAC 224 brush. And I'm going to powder a tiny bit over that. Sleek Makeup Luminous Press Powder, SPF 15. I'm going to pop that a little bit through here. Yeah. Just a little bit. You don't have to wear it together, you can go for a lighter lip or you can just wear the bright lip with nothing on the eyes. Um, but I actually think it looks quite pretty. And I think by the time summer comes around, you'll be surprised what you can um, what you can get away with and how much colour you can get away with. Because, uh, to be honest, we can't afford to all be going out and buying new outfits. I like to express myself with makeup if I can't get a new outfit. I hope you've enjoyed that lovely quick video for you. And um, I'll see you again soon. Bye-bye, take care.